No, I'm Dana Dernford, also known as the nuclear proctologist.org. And you can find my videos in Fukushima presentations at livestream.com. And you'll see that picture showing up as you type in my name at livestream.com. Officials now say Fukushima reactor with MOX fuel leaked directly from containment. Okay. All right. How about it got blown out of the containment? How about it caught fire <laughs> and blew up? <laughs> and caught fire and blew up. And TEPCO says radioactive fallout that polluted the environment in mid-March was likely caused by a leak. Okay. All right. Hey, let me, I gotta look at that one again. No, not that one. Not that one. Not that one. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hang on. That yeah. one. And that one. Okay. A leak, you say. Alrighty. I'm, 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 I'm trying to work with you here. Hang on. Tefco says, the father that polluted the environment in mid-March of 2011 was likely caused by a leak directly from the containment. Oh, okay. They say the vessel likely lost your tightness. <laughs> you think so? <laughs> you can't make it up, see? <laughs> see, you need that picture to go with those headlines to really kind of de de understand the irony of why I kind of spaz sometimes. As you on a tree, that's what they're talking about. Do you, I don't see a leak. Do you see a leak? <laughs> okay. I'm working with you. Hang on. So let's go to the next paragraph. It says the substance in one of the reactors probably leaked directly from the containment vessel. They suspect the heat of the fuel caused the containment vessel to lose air tightness. Okay, let's go back and revisit that one more time. I got no idea what they're talking about. I think everything is looking pretty, pretty spiffy right there right now. Unit three on your right hand side were detonated. I mean, that don't really mean much. When you look down at it from above, I can't see how anything could have got out of that. Particularly when you look at it like that from the side. It's pretty hard to believe there's anything escaped that place. I say I say they should just fire it back up. Just to prove me wrong. Does that look like there's any issues? I can't see any issues. I don't know what all the fuss is about. Anyway, they're over there bashing them at any news saying there's a leak there. And I don't believe them. I just showed you pictures. It looks pretty darn good to me. Don't forget to chop that up and <laughs> come out. And it is out there making fun. A significant release of steam from the night of March the 14th to March the 16th. Okay, hang on. Then. I got to look at that one more time. March the 14th to the 16th, you say. I don't know how it could have got editor, personally. Look at it. Doesn't that look like it's fine? It's just all that fear mongering. I don't know what's wrong with people. Yeah, it blew up and melted down. They had to send helicopters in there and stuff like that because it was kind of dangerous. But that's only because of phobia. That's the Hiroshima syndrome, right? There's no reason they couldn't have ran in there with their brooms and their mops and their dustpans and cleaned it up. You okay? Hang on, Zoe's kind of losing it over there. You got to go outdoors, Goofy. Okay, hang on, folks. Obviously, I can't see why this is an issue. It... I, it, it it really does. I don't imagine why something like this could be an issue. Fukushima had a 9.8. I let Zoe out. A tsunami ran through the country. Because everything blew up. Melted down. Caught fire. and Blew up. And here's unit one. Here's unit two. 100% meltdowns. Melt-throughs. Melt-outs. Unit three. Subject up today. Unit four. We'll save it for a rainy day. But 300 police officers that we know about died doing that job. Oh, they just, no, I'm Dana, they had heart attacks, Dana. Yeah, she seemed to your heart right away. 11 beckles a kilogram uh, will cause permanent lesion in the child's organs, in the livers, kidneys, lungs, respiratory, pituitary, ovary, spleen, kidneys. Yeah, have a nice day. Eat some more, Timmy. Yummy. Mommy, this man scares me. So look at the debris. Look at what happened. Think about, you can't get, if a nuclear power plant is in there, do you think they're going to get power to it in 90 minutes? Do you? Huh? Do you really? Huh? Do you? Do you really? You got something coming to you. Forecast shows Tokyo on a radiation threat. On Sunday and Monday and Tuesday and Wednesday until the end Time. of Time. Once it went through even once, game over. She's done till the end of time, buddy. 
That's why you're worried about a dirty bomb in your community. That's why you don't want a terrorist to get their heads out of it. You can save for the terrorists, but not for that. Water cannons unable to spray reactors. Turn it away because the radiation level. Too many bananas. It was the worst I've ever seen. The little beady eyes followed me everywhere I went. I had to run. A biokinetic model of curium. So once it goes through the chain reaction, curium isotopes are the major byproduct. Curium isotopes, this was in 1989, Dr. Raymond Gilmetti was giving it to dogs, it was killing the dogs the same as the plutonium. And so he studies on plutonium, but the point I'm making is that we're not, cesium and iodine is not the major production that's coming out of the reactor, it's curium, right? You got to remember that, you got to use that against him. Watch him scurry away when you mention curium, trust me. Curium's man-made, it's like plutonium. And the toxicity didn't hate the plutonium dioxide. This is from the chain reaction, right? So 144 beagle dogs. The dogs inhaled one to two sizes. Aerosol, monodispersal, is a 238 plutonium. So this, this is the stuff with extra electrons attached to it, but it's still man-made anyway, right? I only say it that way so you know it's man-made. Out of 144 dogs, death from radiation occurred from 1 to 4 at 5.4 years. Tumors of the lungs, uh, skeleton, liver occurred beginning at about 3 years. Bone tumors found in 3 out of 144 were the most common cause. Lung tumors found in 46 dogs were the second most common cause. Liver tumors in 20 dogs. We're talking about 144 dogs. What happened? Decade after decade after decade, Dr. Raymond Gilmetti's studies have showed. Read your last sentence. These findings in dogs suggest a similar dose-related biological effects could be expected in humans purposely, accidentally, exposed to the 238. But he was studying 239. He was studying americium and neptunium and curium, right? Let's keep going. I see Goddard Journal is out there attacking the children of Fukushima again. Can you get any more lower in Goddard? If that's not the most loathsome thing imaginable on this planet, the most despicable, well, outside of the fact that uh, James Colbert from Fukushima Update put him up there at the front of the page. Yeah, we don't care about the kids in Japan, Dana. Uh, I'm James Colbert, Dana. I got the Colbert Report, Dana. Not worry about Fukushima, Dana. That's why I got the, the Fukushima Update. Not to worry about what you got Fukushima update and you update it all the time. There's nothing to worry about. Now they even got uh, Woods Hole and Uvic up there. They got their own blog with them with James Colbert. Like he totally, he's totally on his on his back with his leg wide open. Come on, do me, do me, do me, Woodsy. <laughs>